right, people. I'm going to talk about this card. I'm going to talk about it. And uh, it's been lately uh, a couple episodes of Iron Man Daily Duels. I talked about how I don't like this card. I think that it's stupid. And I'm going to go ahead and give it its full card review and explain the reason why. So, if you guys don't know already, you guys probably should know. This is number 95, uh, Galaxy Eyes Dark Matter Dragon. You should know. You, you should, you've seen it probably running around... Probably on YouTube, maybe on DM, maybe on Death Pro, Wild Joe Pro. You know, probably seen it across from you. And um, you may have not seen it because you may have lost in like the blink of a fucking eye. But uh, yeah, this card exists. And um, it shouldn't. <laughs> it's as simple as that. It shouldn't. Alright, so. Uh, number 95 Galaxy Eyes Dark Matter Dragon is a Dark Dragon XC effect that is rank 9 with 4,000 attack and 0 defense. So. Same exact stats as a uh, as a uh, Rainbow Dragon, but I can tell you it's much, much, much scarier than Rainbow Dragon just because what it does. So its materials are three level nine monsters, but I doubt you'll go ahead and do that because its other effect, its effect, is probably you're gonna, how you're gonna summon it. So I'm gonna go ahead and begin. So you can also see some of this card by using a Galaxy as XC monster you control as XC material. And of course, XC materials attached to the monster that becomes XC materials of this card. All right. And cannot be used as an exhibit material for an XC7. So you put this on top of someone, but you can't take someone else and put it on top of this. Alright, that's, you know, that's fair. So you'll probably go Tachyon, then you'll probably put a uh, Full Armor. So you can go ahead and attach the exhibit material to pop on your opponent's face-up card. And then go into this. You're probably like, alright, well, you go into this. I mean, it's a 4,000 beater, that's very scary. But, you know, that's, that, that's, not, that's not bad. It's not... No, that, that, that's fine, that's fine. And now I'm going to read this next effect, and you're going to be like, really? I'm like, yeah. Right. When it's called XC Summon, you can send three dragon types with different names from your deck to graveyard. All right, huh, let me read that again. You can send three dragon type monsters with different names from your deck to graveyard. Three dragon types, deck, grave. Three dragons, deck, grave. No. No, Konami, no. No, 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 stop. Stop. Bad Konami. Where's some goddamn newspaper? Roll up this freaking newspaper and smack Konami on the nose. No! No! Stop doing this! It... <sighs> Once again, Konami has made a card where you send dragons from the deck to the fucking graveyard. Like, you would think that Konami would learn not to do this shit. You think, you think Konami would fucking learn? But then they're like, nah, 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 it's good, you know, it's been a couple years since, you know, Dragon Ruler has done anything. So I think that making this card would be totally fine. No. You can't make anything. You can't not make anything for Dragon Rulers. Though that, that is a forbidden thing. You can't do anything with that. Because once you even, once Dragon Rulers get their goddamn foot through the fucking door, they will Fucking slam that door open and beat your ass! It's, 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 I mean, we've, we've been through this, Konami. We, that's the sad thing. That's the sad thing. We have two. Two fucking cards banned because they send dragons. Two! Two! So it, it's not like, you know. And of course, they weren't intentionally supposed to be doing like this, of course. One being Future Fusion. And of course, that was before Dragon Run, but it's still does the same thing, you know, Future Fusion existed, we just being just as dumb as Sir George, but like, uh, Future Fusion, uh, here's a Five God Dragon and Five Head Dragon, or you want to fuck you want to call it, I'm gonna send, fucking, bam, four Dragon Rulers, and let's go, Eclipse Riven in there, facts, you know, go ahead and banish Eclipse Riven, and banish one of the Dragon Rulers, summon, get my Redem, get that Dragon Rulers, effect special summon, go ahead and summon one of these, and summon this, and do that, like, no! No, so, 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 Future Fusion got banned. Got banned with, with the shenanigans that Chaos Dragons were doing. Banned. Then turn around. Dragon Rose are still at 30. Dragon's Ring. Dragon's Ring. Once per turn, you go ahead and send a dragon from your deck. Uh, banned. Banned. Three to banned. Banned because of Dragon Rose. You don't learn your fucking lesson, do you, Kanani? Don't, you know. And now you create this to send more dragons. More fucking dragons. This card is fucking dick. No. 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 Dragon Ravine, yes. I'm, I'm very afraid of you sending a lot of dragons. But you know what? At least fucking Dragon Ravine is a 3,000 beater. Fucking Future Fusion. 
Well, no, technically, that's going to be a 5,000 beater, but, you know, the way that people were running Future Fusion back then, they kind of forgot that they would get XGD. They were, they were just like, they all they gave a shit about was putting dragons in the graveyard. And the, Konami needs to realize that. That's what dragons have turned into. That's what dragons have turned into. There was no, oh, yo, back in my day, we used to summon blue eyes by tributing too. And it was a big old strong 3,000 beater that was so beautiful and honored in a dragon. No, no. Like, um, back in my day, I would go ahead and just send the fucking red eyes little baby chick. I mean, the blue eyes baby little egg thing. And go ahead and search it, maybe trade it in to the graveyard. Oh, look, it's in the graveyard dragon. I mean, Silver's Cry. You know, that's it. Dragons send to the grave. They send to the grave. Dragons, that's what they do. So you can't give them something to do that. You know, you took away cards that did that, and then you give them the same fucking shit. It's just like, wow, Konami, you don't fucking learn. You don't fucking learn. What's next? What's next? Oh, wait. Oh, right, right. Chaos Emperor. <laughs> we fixed it. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. Still stupid, you know? Same thing, you know? It's just like, you don't fucking learn, do you? History repeats itself, but goddamn, Konami. God damn. No. 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 It may be, you know, probably, it's probably going to be good in OCG, you know. OCG, they're a little bit more, you know, liberal than us, so I don't know. But if this shit ever comes out here in TCG, don't be surprised if this shit gets banned. It sends three dragons. That's enough. If we are going to the extreme to ban Dragon's Ravine... With the Dragon Rulers at one and ban Dragon's Ring and not touch that shit, you don't really think that we're not going to ban this. We're going to ban it. We're going to ban it. You know what the dumb thing is? No, I, oh, well, let me finish this. Go ahead and go. This thing, cause, uh, the, uh, tactics, oh, I'm not even done. Tactics to material. This card can make up to two attacks of monsters during the battle phase. So 4,000 beater that's going to come at you twice. Get two of your monsters, you know? Yeah. The attack of fucking... Fucking... Quasar... That can attack twice on monsters. At least it's monsters. At least it can't hit you directly. But God, you know. But seriously, seriously, this card would probably be banned. Probably if it ever came out here in the TCG, it would be banned. There'd be no if and buts about it because literally it's just 30k. And that's what and that's what I really hate about it is that what it's doing. It's not cool. It's not unique. It's not like oh wow that's so fucking cool and pro no. It, it's literally. You playing with yourself, except this new sp sparkly OTK. You know, instead of me using a Saki deck and drawing Exodia or burning you with Chain Burn, I just try to fucking get a rank 8 Galaxy Oz in the field as quick as possible, because once I get that out, you're done. You're done. Just bam, Tachyon, rank up, full armor, detach, blow something up if I feel like it, as long as it's face out. Bam, this guy. Send two Dragon Rulers, Quip Swipe him. Quip Swipe him, go ahead and banish Red him. That one of the Dragon Rulers banished the Dragon Ruler you just said and Red him. Summon that Dragon Ruler. Grab yourself, goddamn, uh, uh, Red him back. If you did detach the full armor, make sure you detach the Tachyon. So you can go ahead and banish the Dragon Roar or banish whatever it is, summon, or whatever Dragon else you have on the field. You know, or probably the Dragon Roar. So that's just summon Redem. Redem's bring back Tachyon, go right back into full armor, go ahead and detach, blow some of the go right back into another one of this guy because they didn't make his effect even once per turn. I know. <laughs> you can, what? You can only use the effect, this effect of, you know, Dark Matter. Once per turn? Nah. Nah. No. No. So go to another one. Send three more dragons. You have two fucking 4,000 beaters and red them. They each can detach X material to attack two monsters. Like, yeah, no, 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 no. You're getting kicked in the face. It's game. It's game. Tack, 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 game. Like, see? See what you did. You see what you fucking do. You can't. You can't. You can't give dragons an inch. You cannot do that. Because you give them an inch to take a fucking mile. That's it's pretty it's pretty obvious. Why 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 is nothing Dragon Ruler related even moving in TCG despite Dragon Rulers doing nothing? Huh? Why the fuck is the Breeze Dragon at one? Why is Gold Sark at one? Why is fucking Swords at one? Why is Gold Sark still I mean, why is fucking Dragon's Ravine still banned? Because they're dragon related. And Konami don't want to touch that shit. Because they know that if they move anything and spark any interest in Dragon Rulers, that shit will come back. You know? And of course, I get it. OCG, OCG, they, they don't mind Dragon Rulers. You know, it took them a cool minute to go ahead and, you know, put them at the place that they are and here in TCG. But we were like, no, no, 
you know? Right after one fucking, you know, their prime, then the ravine format, and then dead. Like, there was no fucking third format like there was in fucking OTG. No. <laughs> you know? And this, and this card just brings it right back, you know? The strength of Dragon Rules. The strength of Chaos Dragons. The strength of pure, raw, OTKing, dragon-sending power. All in one tight little, you know, beautiful 4,000 beater bow. Like, no. No. This card is bad. And watch this card be the one that get banned. You know? Let's just watch the wrong cards get banned. That's the funny thing. Watch the wrong card get banned. You know? If literally all you could send was those blue eyes baby chicks and you know, some, some fucking, you know, little beating dragon shit from your fucking deck to your graveyard. No one would give a shit. But if you can send Dragon Rulers and Eclipse Ribbons, then no. No? If, if I ran, you want to know what? If I ran Konami, the Dragon Rulers, banned. Banned. Because whenever, because literally, they're not even, I get you want to save one of each for each of the different attributes. No. Because literally, they're, all they've been doing is just fucking with dragons. And if they're going to fuck with dragons, then they can go fuck themselves. Like, no. 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 Dragon Rulers have literally been a plague on this game since their existence. All right? Never forget. So, no, they would be banned. And you know what else would be gone? You know what else would be fucking gone? Redum? No, not Redum. Redum's, Redum's your little your little cutesy play. I don't give a shit. No. No. Eclipse Riven. How the fuck has Eclipse Riven never gotten hit? Ever? It's been in like five. Five tier one decks. Like, seriously. Like, seriously. Chaos Dragon. It was in Ravine Rulers. It's it was in it's in Shadals. It was in Herodics. It's in this. It's literally Eclipse Wyvern. Like what? Why? Well, Eclipse Wyvern has the ability to search for Redum, Dark Armed, and fucking Chaos Emperor Dragon. That is not. That does that not warrant that shit being addressed? Like no, no. Literally, it's been in so many fucking top tier decks that. I'm, I don't know. I don't understand how that card did not get hit. And you can't put it at one. You can't. You, you, put, you only need one. The card that... The Eclipse Wyvern should be banned. Like, there's no ifs, ands, buts about it. Eclipse Wyvern should be banned. You know? Red M's still at one. Dark Arm's still at one. But Eclipse Wyvern should be at one. Fucking JD. I forgot about JD. Search for JD. Like, what the fuck? How the fuck has Eclipse Wyvern never been hit? I don't understand that shit. I, I, I'm flabbergasted to the fact that Eclipse Wyvern has never been hit. I'm like... What the fuck is this? Look at all this shit that you're searching with this. Just send it to the grave. Burn the shit. Bam. Like, no. 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 But Konami's stupid. Eclipse Ravens should be hit. Eclipse Ravens should be banned. Like, a card that can search those four shit should not even exist. Like, no. 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 You're on crack. Yeah. Like, literally. Literally. If you didn't know, if I literally came up to you and said and pitched you an idea, hey, all right, I created a fake card. It's a dragon, and it searches for Judgment Dragon, Chaos Emperor, Dark Armed, and Red Eyes Darkness Metal. You would be like, you're on crack. The card is broken. Uh, 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 oh, you mean a Quip Striver? Like, it's, like I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No. The only thing is, oh, they can't search for Dragon Rulers. And? Like, shit. Like, seriously. Seriously, so many, so much chaos caused by fucking Eclipse Riven. Dragon Rule should be banned, and Eclipse Riven should be banned. If that shit was done, then what would you really do with this card? Yeah? What would you really do? You're not going off with your fucking Red and Play, unless you already have Red in your hand. But you're not going off with your Red and Play. You're not gonna, you know, send, you know, you know, three dragon, two dragon rulers and close Riven and then summon and a dragon ruler and get that close Riven. And you're not, you're not doing that shit because those shit and then all the dragon rulers are banned and close Riven's banned. You know? just think, just think how different the game would be. Just think, just think how different the game would be if close Riven didn't fucking exist. Chaos dragons wouldn't have been as scary or as powerful. Yeah, yeah. All right, all right. Fucking, fucking Lightstorm's ruler. That wouldn't even be a thing. Lightstorm ruler wouldn't even be a thing without close Riven. You splash the Dragon Rulers in to banish Equips Riven search for your JD. So, Equips Riven is the fucking centerpiece of that goddamn deck. So, Light Lightstorm Rulers wouldn't even be a thing. Shadal's what they're fucking doing right now with Dark Arm, that wouldn't even be a thing. I don't even think they would run the BB Chaos Dragons, because there'd be no point. There'd be no point. That whole, you know, Construct, send Squamata, then Squamata's gonna send one, you know, so, yeah. 
fuse with you know fuse with uh squamata and equips riven for construct you know so uh you know construct's gonna send you a dark monster and then uh Squad Mountain is going to send you a Dark Monster. So that's already three. That's perfectly three. You know? And you send Eclipse Wyvern, so that's going to go ahead and banish Dark Arm because that's not broken. Then you're going to go ahead and summon one of your baby Chaos Dragons by banishing Eclipse Wyvern. Get Dark Arm to your hand. Oh, look. I just happen to have three Dark Arm. Like, no. 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 Stop. Stop. No. Eclipse Wyvern should be banned. Like, if, you know? Because, like I said, if we even put it at one, if we even put it at one, you can still do the stupid shit that you do. You only need one. They should be banned. And Dragon Rules, they should be banned. But watch, watch Dragon Rules stay at 1 and find nothing Dragon Rules related that's broken that shouldn't, you know, that literally, if you would ban Dragon Rules, you could bring back Dragon Ravine. That shit's not going to get addressed, you know. It's just going to keep it the way it is. Fucking, fucking Clutch Iron is going to stay at 3 for some odd fucking reason. And this card's going to come out in the TG and get banned. And literally anything that they fucking create, ban, 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 just give it the fucking ban hammer instead of addressing the problems in the first place. You know? No, uh, oh no, well, let me get this straight. Now, just because we banned the Dragon Rose doesn't mean that Future Fusion come back. Future Fusion's still broken. But, uh, uh, you know, it, it's just stupid. It's just stupid. It's all stupid. It's all stupid, and I'm just... I wouldn't say that I'm tired of it. I'm just... I'm just giving up really i'm just i'm just giving up because clearly konami just doesn't give a shit anymore they just tell they don't learn from their past mistakes they don't think you know they they just don't you know Konami fucking a rotting shit still broken or rotting shit to the point where it's not even playable or fucking unbanning snatch steel for three months or you know fucking Creating burning abyss like uh, it's just stupid. It's just stupid. You're just you're just milking this fucking cast cow, and this isn't the game of you girl that I fell in love with when I was a kid. This isn't the fucking show that I woke up on Saturday mornings and watched. This isn't. This is a fucking war zone. It's ridiculous. It's it's, it's a fucking war zone, and Konami's the fucking dictator. Konami's fucking Hitler. <laughs> yep, Konami is fucking Hitler, and we're all Jews. Cause goddamn. But of course, some of you guys are selected Jews. You know, some of you guys actually got promoted to be Nazis and actually oppressed the rest of us. But, you know, fucking Konami's the head oppressor. <sighs> Alright, I'm done. I'm done ranting. I apologize for this video being long, but, you know, uh, these, these card review videos wouldn't be long if I didn't have shit to rant about. You know, if Konami would just do their fucking job right, if they would just do shit right, <laughs> then I wouldn't have anything to complain about, would I? All I would do, I would upload a video and be like, isn't Konami doing a great job? But I will never upload a video like that. Now will I? Alright. So, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Card Review. So tell me what you guys think about this whole thing in the comment section below. So, thanks for watching. And I will see you guys next Tuesday with a card to look at. To review. Hopefully not as angry. Literally, it's been like, angry. Then, on Tuesday we were happy and, and reviewing it. And then we're back to angry. So, hopefully on Tuesday we'll review a card that's actually nice and cool. And I won't have to sit here and rant for almost 20 minutes. Alright guys, thanks for watching.